makes sense. Uh, all right. So would you tell everybody uh, where you're from and what you do? My name is Erin Walsh. I work at Scripps in La Jolla, and I'm a speech pathologist. I'm wearing Home Depot and Party City. Uh, and so tell me today what you're... Tell me today what you're performing. I'll be performing You and I by Lady Gaga. And what's up? What made you want to choose that song, other than Peter said you can't sing show tunes? Because I wanted to sing Don Juan, and I wasn't allowed to sing musical theater. And then I proposed to Della, and now I'm singing you and I, and I love it, and it's going to be great. Alright, are you ready to be scoped? I'm ready to be scoped. Alright. Can someone hold my scepter? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that feels awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the martini? All right.
Mr. Meg, Meg knows that she's next. So uh, that was fantastic. How would you like to be a judge? Who's a fan of Aaron Walsh? <laughs> Me too. He, he did, he did. He let us know where your roots were there a little bit. Where are my roots? You know, you know where they are. <laughs> You're leaving the audience hanging. Come on, tell them. I don't know. <laughs> I thought it was awesome. I thought it was awesome. In fact, I have not seen the posterior frontal wall move like that. And I think the movement was causing this great, you know, timbre variation was phenomenal. And the growls, I love the growls. And that kind of saw quality, mm. yeah, you nailed it. Loved it. Yeah. Loved it. Well, first things first, you might want to disinfect that scepter. I mean, I love how you dress Lady Gaga, and that Home Depot line is fabulous. Thank you. I'm just wondering if it's providing any visual obstruction of the audience. The frightening part is that I was not uh, picked up this morning on the airport <laughs> as um, a curtain rod terrorist. <laughs> you look hey, great. I, I appreciate your dedication to the cause. Thank you. Well, I, I thought it was horrible. You didn't embarrass yourself in any way. It was 